Hey girl, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, we are doing an experiment here. So I did my nails and I used the Kiss Vogue-ish Press-On Nails. I just thought that they were so pretty and I really want to be able to use the Press-Ons without them popping off on me. So I accidentally came upon this. So I had used the nail tip and glue set and I used the nail tips that came in the actual Born Pretty nail tips and glue set and one of them popped off as I was getting ready to leave and go somewhere and girl I, I can't just walk around with one missing fingernail. I hate it. It drives me insane. So I ran in here and I grabbed some nail glue and I just glued it back on. I was like it'll be fine. You know it'll get me through this evening and then I can just redo this set later well it didn't come off that evening it was still on the next day it ended up lasting like another week and a half so i was like okay well i might be on to something here so when the nail popped off it still had the nail glue on my nail so i was basically gluing the nail tip to the nail glue so that's what i did for this set so all you're gonna do is put um, the nail glue from the Beatles nail tip and glue set or the Born Pretty nail tips and glue set. Um, I use the Beatles glue this time, but it really doesn't matter. And then you're gonna take and you're gonna glue your nails to the nail glue, if that makes sense. But if it doesn't make sense, girl, just keep on watching and I'll show you how to do it in the next portion of this video because I actually put these on last night. That is another tip that I have for you is to make sure that you do your nails at nighttime. Um, put your nails on and then go to bed, girl, because it's going to give the nail glue enough time to actually cure so you know how they're like hold it down for five seconds which i normally hold it down for more than five seconds i usually hold it for about 30 seconds or so and then i will keep just going back and pressing them down but if you do it at night time and then you go to bed then when you wake up the glue is fully cured because it's had hours upon hours to actually cure without you pulling up your pants or putting your hands in a bunch of water or anything like that. So it really does help if you do them at nighttime and give the glue uh, plenty of time to fully cure. I am going to be checking back in with you randomly so we can see um, how long they last because I glued them all on the same way so that I could test out the whole set because girl I really want to get to where I can go get a set of press on nails that are like full color that you can't see through because you can use the see through ones with the nail glue from the nail tip and glue sets you can glue those on easily but if they're not see through the light can't penetrate to glue them on so I'm trying to figure out another way to do it I'm hoping to get, I would love to get two or three weeks out of them, but if I get a week, I'm hoping to get two or three weeks, okay? That's what I'm hoping for. I'm, fingers crossed we get two or three weeks out of these. Okay, girls, so let's get into the portion where I show you how to apply these. Okay, girls, so we're going to go ahead and get started, and I'm going to be using this Kiss Press On set today. Um, we're just experimenting um a little bit today because i think i accidentally came across a good thing hopefully fingers crossed this works so this is the nail dehydrator these are not necessary but in my opinion they really do um, help your set to stay on your nails i've used it without doing the nail dehydrator and primer and the nail tips and glue sets themselves do not last as long. So that's why I always do um, nail dehydrator and primer. Um, this, These are just out of sets I already had. So I will have everything linked below for you. So now that I have the nail primer and nail dehydrator on, I'm going to let it dry for just a few seconds. Okay, so now I'm just going to take the Beatles nail glue and I'm gonna put a coat on my nails and I'm gonna cure it for 60 seconds
So now that I have the Beatles nail glue dry, I'm going to take a cotton swab with alcohol and I'm going to rub over it because it's still sticky and I don't want it to be sticky when I'm putting the kiss glue on top of it. So I'm just going to wipe with alcohol. And this is the kiss glue that came in this little set here. I just thought it was really pretty and I know that like these ones you can use with just the nail glue um, you don't have to do it this way but again I'm just experimenting here girl I'm just I'm trying to figure out a way that I can use the press ones that are solid colors like this because you can't use the solid colors with the Beatles glue so I'm just trying to figure out a way I can use it because I really like um, press ones that are solid colors so okay so now that they're dry I'm actually gonna take and put a little bit of glue on top of the Beatles nail glue I'm gonna take a little bit of that kiss glue and just put right on top of it and then I'm gonna take the nail and put just a little bit on the back of the nail here and I'm gonna let them dry for just a few seconds that way they kind of get tacky and I'm just going to start at the back of my cuticle, not on my cuticle, but close to it. And I'm going to press down. And you're going to hold it there for about 30 seconds. You just want to really press it down onto the nail to get all them air bubbles out of there. So now I'm going to go to the next one. I'm going to add some of the Kiss Glue on top of that Beetle nail glue. And I'm going to add it to the back of this one. And these nails I did have to file a little bit on each side to get them to correctly fit. I'm going to let that dry for a second. And I'm just going to hold on this one for another minute. Another tip I'm going to say is to do these before you go to bed. I know it sounds crazy. But if you do them before you go to bed, it's going to give the glue the best chance to dry before you're really doing anything with your hands to where the glue will have time to cure before you really start doing anything with your hands that could pop your nails off. Okay, so now that I have them all glued on, I'm actually going to take a base coat and I'm going to put on top of them. And then I'm going to use a top coat. And of course, you already know, I'm going to take my favorite cuticle oil. Okay, you guys, so this is the completed set. Um, I'm going to be checking back in with you and we're going to see how long these are going to last. Hey, you guys, I just wanted to jump on here with a quick update on my nails. Um, I put them on Monday. Today is Friday. Um, me and my kids just got home from volunteering. So we go down and unload trucks and stock shelves. So I put them to the test and I didn't lose one today. So I'm super excited about that. Fingers crossed we get a couple more weeks out of these nails. But I'll be back in a few days to let you know. Hey girl, I am back with my last update for my nails because I have broke two of them. I broke my thumb and I also broke my middle finger. But this hand is still intact. This one... Um, the only thing that's wrong with it is the paint is chipping off the corner of this nail. But other than that, they're all holding pretty well. Um, I actually broke them digging through some boxes and stuff. So it was probably just me being more rough. But um, just the tip of them broke off. The part that I have glued to my nail is still there. So I think my experiment actually worked pretty well. Overall, I'm satisfied and I'm definitely going to get another set that is a fully colored and give that a try again um, because it lasted 12 days altogether. So um, 
yeah, they last at 12 days. I'm pretty, I'm pretty happy about that. But I'm standing here because I wanted to show you guys this. My husband put up the shelf for me and I put all my nail polish and stuff on here. I think it looks so cute. I love it. I'm so glad that he put that up for me. But yeah, girl, I just wanted to get on here and give you the last update. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next one. Bye.